This is Code.org. I'm currently working on the Frozen Hour of Code course. The name of it is Code with Anna and Elsa. I'm on level 15. So let's see. Now let's create 20 overlapping circles, turning 18 degrees between each circle. Ooh, that sounds technical. All right, so it looks like this is where our code goes. We can always drag over blocks. This is the game screen. They want us to do this in eight blocks, and we currently have four in this area. I'm going to go ahead and hit run to test out what uh, what the code does so far. Okay, Elsa made one circle. Try replacing the question marks. And we can always hit this for a hint. After we hit run, if it doesn't uh, come back totally successful, they give us a hint option. Let's see. We want to replace jump forward. Oh, ooh, jump forward. 20 overlapping circles. So if there's 20 circles, 18 degrees between each. So I think this is where we turn 18 degrees. I don't know how close they are. They look pretty close to me. Let's go ahead and test out 50. I might be totally wrong, but it's okay because you can hit run and reset as many times as you want. That looked all right. Okay. And they want me to do this 20 times, but in under eight blocks. Under eight blocks is the key part of this. That means we're going to need to use a repeat function. Because writing this out or dragging this code over 20 times, it would take forever. And it would be a lot more than eight blocks. So I'm going to drag all of this into the repeat function. And then I'm going to click it up here. So when the computer hits this part of the code, what it does is say, oh, I need to run this 20 times. Let me create a circle. Okay, and then I'm going to jump forward by 50 pixels. I'm going to turn right for the new circle, and then I'm going to create a circle. And then it hits the bottom of this, or and, the, and then I'm going to turn right. It hits the bottom of the pink and says, okay, I, uh, do, have I run this 20 times? No, I've only run it once. Okay, so now I'm going to drop through the code. I'll create another circle. I'll jump. I'll turn bottom. Whoop. Have I run this 20 times? Nope, I've only run it twice, so I'm going to drop into this code. And then once it does run this 20 times, if there was code below it, the computer would then run that. But I don't think we uh, need code below it, so let's, I'm going to increase the speed a bit. Let's test this out. Looking good. Go, go, go. Elsa's getting a bit of a workout, I think. Is she doing magic or is that just snow? I guess it would be magic anyways. How can she just... I mean her powers, but... Oh, almost there. Oh, great. We did it. So this was the code that worked for me. Using this repeat 20 and then having 18 and I guess 50. Knowing that they were 50 apart was kind of uh, difficult. Okay, to the next level.